Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Calculator Techniques. In this video guys, we will discuss about definite integral which is an integral with lower limit and upper limit. I have prepared 7 examples for this video, then we will answer each and every example. Okay, so we will proceed to answer example number 1. Uh, evaluate integral of 2x sine x squared dx with lower limit of 0 and upper limit of pi over 4. Okay guys, uh, in order to solve this example, your scientific calculator must be in radian mode. Otherwise, you will get a different answer. Okay, to, to set your calculator into radian mode, just press shift, then mode, then select 4. Okay, we are ready to answer example number one. Integral sign to alpha x sine alpha x x squared. Close parenthesis. Move your cursor going to lower limit, enter zero, then upper limit, uh, fraction button, then shift, pi over 4 then press equal the answer guys is letter b 0 0.184 if your calculator is in degree mode then you will get different answer okay guys so just please take note when uh, an equation is in a trigonometric function then your calculator must be in region mode okay guys so we will proceed to example number two so our calculator we will return it to degree mode okay three so example number two evaluate the integral of ln x dx with lower limit one and upper limit of e okay so integral sign ln alpha x in close parenthesis move your cursor enter one then move cursor up then enter e alpha E then press equal. The answer, guys, is letter C. This topic is not that uh, kind of difficulties because you can uh, enter it directly to your calculator with the limit. Okay, so we will proceed to example number three. Evaluate the integral of x to the x cube um, multiplied by x cube then multiplied by x squared dx from 0 to 2 so the limit here guys is lower limit is 0 and upper limit is 2 okay we will solve from our calculator integral of integral then shift e then alpha x then shift x cube move your cursor then alpha x then shift x cube then alpha x then x squared move your cursor to lower limit then enter 0 upper limit then 2 press equal guys the answer is 6955.9 and we cannot find the right answer from the traces so please take note also guys that in during board examinations there are some problems that having an error okay uh, the given equation doesn't have the right answer from the traces okay like this example uh, we cannot find the right answer from the traces so the right answer here guys is 6955.9 okay but, but what we have to do guys we will remove the x cube because this equation has an error okay we cannot find the right answer from the traces but during checking of your uh, quiz, uh, test paper the the right answer will be in uh, traces okay so you have to select which is the right but we don't know because the right answer is uh, not in the not from the traces so we will remove x cube because this equation is wrong 
not fit from the choices so we will delete okay then press equal <clears throat> therefore the answer guys is 993.319 or 993.32 so letter a that's the answer for example number three is letter a and take note that during board examinations uh, there are problems that having an error given and you cannot find the right answer from the choices okay so we will proceed to example number four evaluate the integral of one over x ln x dx from lower limit e to upper limit e squared okay so integral sign fraction button one over alpha x ln alpha x close parenthesis move your cursor to lower limit then enter a alpha a move your cursor to upper limit then alpha e squared okay then press equal the answer is 0 0.693 now guys you cannot find uh, 0 0.693 from the choices so we will calculate choices also which choices has an equal of 0 0.693 okay so the answer here guys is letter c as you can see ln of 2 we will check equal to see the answer is 0 0.693 and the answer is letter c okay guys we will proceed to example number five evaluate the integral of 3 to the power of x divided by e to the power of x dx lower limit of 0 and upper limit of 1 okay so integral sign uh, fraction button 3 then press this x button then alpha x move your cursor down then alpha e this button x to the power then alpha x move your cursor down to lower limit then zero move to upper limit then enter one and press equal the answer guys is 1.05096 or 1.051 which is letter c from the choices okay guys we have answer five examples so two examples remaining so we will proceed to example number six sorry example number six evaluate the integral of two divided by square root of x minus x dx to the limit or lower limit of three upper limit of five then integral open parenthesis fraction button two move your cursor down then square root of alpha x then move your cursor then minus alpha x close parenthesis move your cursor to lower limit then enter 3 then upper limit enter 5 then press equal the answer guys is negative 5.98 which is letter b from the choices so okay we will go to answer example number seven which is the last example from this topic so example number seven integ evaluate the integral sine to the five theta cosine to the five theta data then lower limit of zero and upper limit of pi over two so this time guys you have to shift your calculate calculator into region mode okay so we will press shift in mode select four okay then integral sign sign um, we will use x as our theta and then alpha x in close parenthesis press this button x to the power of five then move your cursor down then cosine alpha x then close 
uh, x to the power of 5 then move your cursor to lower limit then enter 0 then upper limit button then shift pi over 2 then press equal The answer, guys, is letter B, 1 over 60. So that's all for this video, guys, which is uh, we sold seven examples from uh, definite integral, which has having uh, zero limit, uh, which having lower limit and upper limit. Next video, we will calculate, we will solve and discuss about indefinite integral. Indefinite integral doesn't have the limit okay so see you next video guys thank you for watching